everybody. Today we're here to talk about internal and external parasites on cats and dogs. Um, so the first thing we want to talk about is things to look for if you think your pet might have external parasites, meaning something on the skin or in their ears. If that happens, you might see things like um, bald spots or fur loss somewhere on the body. Um, for fleas, a very common area for them to scratch is at the base of the tail. So oftentimes you'll see kind of a bald tail area if they have fleas. If they have ear mites, you'll notice them scratching a lot around their ears because their ears are really itchy. Um, or you'll see them maybe licking at their abdomen a lot if they have an allergy from flea bites. Um, if you notice any of that, you'll want to take your cat to the vet for confirmation that there's no other medical issues and then get an appropriate flea prevention product. Um, and, and similar with dogs where um, if a dog has external parasites as well, they might have some fur loss on their body um, or some irritation of the skin or something like that where you can have them examined by, by your vet and get an appropriate treatment for them.